Hey there. Today I Nirupama of class 12A studying in Green Fingers Global School Kharghar is going to explain Gauss theorem to all of you in detail. According to the Gauss law, the total flux linked within a closed surface is 1 upon epsilon not times the charge enclosed by the closed surface. This theorem gives a relationship between the total flux passing through any closed surface and the net charge enclosed within that surface that is e dot ds is equal to 1 upon epsilon not times q for example a point charge q is placed inside a cube of side a now as per the gauss law the flux through each face of the cube is q by 6 epsilon not The unit for electric flux is newton meter square per coulomb. This law is one of Maxwell's four equations which form the basis of classical electrodynamics. Gauss's law can be used to derive Coulomb's law and vice versa. The electric field is the basic concept to know about electricity. Generally, The electric field of the surface is calculated by applying Coulomb's law. But to calculate the electric field distribution in a closed surface, we need to understand the concept of Gauss law. It explains about the electric charge enclosed in a closed surface. As per the Gauss theorem, the total charge enclosed in a closed surface is proportional to the total flux enclosed by the surface. Therefore, if phi is the total flux and epsilon not is electric constant and the electric charge enclosed by the surface is q, then the Gauss law formula is expressed by phi is equal to q by epsilon not. Any hypothetical closed surface enclosing a charge is called the Gaussian surface of that charge. Equipotential surface is any surface with the same electric potential at every point the gauss theorem relates the flow of electric field lines to the charges within the enclosed surface if there are no charges enclosed by a surface then the net electric flux remains zero this means that the number of electric field lines entering the surface is equal to the field lines leaving the surface note the gauss law is only a restatement of the coulomb's law if you apply the gauss theorem to a point charge enclosed by a sphere you will get back the coulomb's law easily gauss theorem is valid for any closed surface and for any general charge distribution the net flux enclosed through a closed surface due to a charge lying outside the closed surface is zero if the net charge enclosed by a closed surface is zero then flux through it is also zero electric flux density is equal to total flux divided by area and its unit is newton per coulomb thank you